Good morning to you. Let's get right to some breaking news. Steve Kelly is out on the scene. Look at all the bolt holes in this car through the passenger side door and the passenger window. They are moving the car now as we thought um, they had to jump start it because maybe there was some damage to it, but we're getting a close up look. This is at Philadelphia Police Headquarters, and you notice the lift sticker. We were told it was an Uber driver, but there's bullet holes in the windshield right here at 15th and Callow Hill, and there's two bullets through the passenger door and passenger window, and then pass passenger back door and front door have bullet holes in it. Uh, this is a real close look. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. We were told originally 12 shots. I'm counting. Again, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve shots through the passenger side, and then two more shots uh, through the windshield. At least 14 holes through this uh, car, and you can see it's a lift sticker. This driver was at 24th and Poplar. He tells police people in a white vehicle just started shooting at him as he was on his way to pick up a customer, and he knew where the new police headquarters was, and he got right to the ramp here at new police headquarters back window shot out too so there's another shot we we're watching detectives pull out bullets and put them in their envelopes envelopes uh evidence envelopes and so there's probably 15 shots at least fired into this car who knows how many shots he missed with but uh what a scene here and we're at the ramp where commissioner outlaw pulls in every morning right behind police headquarters at 15th and callow hill not too far from where this happened you can see fifth street 15th street is blocked off callow hill was for a time obviously a crime here but what a story uh we have no idea if this was an attempted carjacking or an attempted robbery or an attempted murder obviously uh why they would shoot without getting the car first or uh, without getting uh, anything from the driver, but he wisely sped away, avoided getting killed apparently, uh, got wounded, got help from police, got a ride to the hospital, and that's where we are right now with this investigation. We'll obviously update you throughout the morning, guys. Yeah, it really just is stunning looking at all those bullet holes, Steve. We appreciate it. We'll get another update in just a moment.